My name is Jaron James. I am 16 years of age. I do track and field. The name of my club is Mercury and I attend secondary, secondary school and I'm from Bonaparte. Track and field makes me feel good because I'm not always home and just lying down the whole day. I get to go to training and do different exercises. So I feel better than being home and not doing nothing. Um, at school, sometimes I can be a low person and sometimes I can be a quiet person. It depends on type of mood I in, but most times I mostly a loud person because I always talk and everything, but I still pay attention in class and do my work even though, as teachers are say, Jerenders make plenty of noise, but he does always do his work still. I have other persons in my class that are do track and feeder, so most times they'll be talking about some, somebody are we who run this or who throw that standard or something, so. I have a bigger brother. He is 23 years of age. He is a gym trainer and when he was in school, he used to play football. How I got into track and field was because of one of my friends. Um, I used to run at first in Signal and the coach that used to train me here got onto Sir Bishop and sent me to Mercury. And at first I was running in Mercury, then Sir said that I look, at, look like a trainer. So he sent me to throw and then that's how everything started. I become a, a throw. In age 14, I started running and then I went on to train. What I like about this sport is it relieves me from stress from besides of thinking of schoolwork, I can fall back on train discuss and shop put. What is responsible for my success so far is me not giving up and my coach and my parents pushing me and guiding me in the right path for me not to give up and always try no matter how hard it gets. Some of the things I'm proud of is being able to be selected to travel on the national team and me making my standard that I set for myself. The biggest lesson I have learned is in life, things are never easy. And no matter what, no matter how hard it gets, never give up or keep trying because one day you will see the purpose for it. At times in training, and in competitions, there are times that I couldn't make the throw that I wanted. And even though I didn't make it, I still never give up. I keep trying. My future goal, uh, I want to become a national athlete for Trinidad and Tobago. And I want to become a mechanical engineer. Some of the people I look up to are Frederick Dakers. He is from Jamaica and he is also the best thrower in this course, in the Caribbean. I also look up to Chevy Warren. He is my coach and he is also a gold medalist in Carifta Games. I also look up to Jaden Scott, that is my teammate and he is also someone who achieved a medal in character games. I am grateful for life and being in Trinidad and Tobago and having a great coach that doesn't give up on me, even though I make a lot of mistakes in training and competitions. I wish for Trinidad and Tobago to have more opportunities for athletes so they can make a career out of it to represent Trinidad and Tobago on the world stage.
I want to thank everybody for viewing my Express YSS interview. And if you are from Tobago, you can join the Mercury Athletic Club. They are also on Facebook and Instagram. I'm back.